Emmy one six two held together by glue. Wearables, it could have changed the war. Oh, we're playing the good old one six three. No, we're playing the one six two. Free. One of them's a rocket, and the other one's a jet. One of them has six minutes of fuel. The other one also has actually. Wait a minute, that's like six minutes of fuel, like twenty two max. But still, that's not the issue. Mm, don't have that much energy actually. If I can lead well, I might be able to get the kill. No. Fuck. I can't turn fighter zero. What the fuck am I thinking? Okay, maybe I can outrun him though. Fuck it, whip. I need to outrun him. Okay, now I can stop whipping. Yeah, fuck your nip on steel. All my friends are using crop. Wait, I had flaps down the whole time? No wonder I was going slow. Hey, bomber! I love intercepting these. <laughs> it was going so well. And such is my life. Back to the hangar. B-17. Yes. Oh wait, the TA-152. The TA Go hunt some fucking fighter planes. Dawn your 335, fair enough, you can have it. Doesn't mean I'm still not going to chase it though, just in case it kills you. Ah, oh, TA-152 got the kill as well. Just saying 152, you should probably be dogfighting some other stuff and left it for the 335, but whatever. Oh, I'm dead. I fucked up all my maneuvering. It's my fault. I'll just try and get some speed and see if I can do anything with it. It's nice to have some groupies following me around. Oh, even this guy's trying to get some. Well, if, the, if my allies need to find the enemy, they know they're all on me. Alright, I'm going to show them like the one trick in the book that I do know. What's this guy up to? It's like fucking Ralph Wiggum playing with his Legos over here. And I'm just like, activate sweat mode. Where is my airfield? Please. How am I not dead yet? What are they firing? Practice rounds? Oh no, I'm losing some. I lost my flaps. I'm hearing those chunk chunks of cannons. Oh my. I have. This is my full wiggling capability now. Fuck off. Gear! Gear! <laughs> I have no agent output! Agent output is so low! Fuck it, I'm gonna land! Ah! I'm still going, actually, can I take off again? I don't- Once I stop, I won't be able to take off. Go! Fly! Ah! <laughs> oh, at least I get a soft landing. If I was able to get that gear down and locked, I was just hoping that basically that guy was like stall fighting me. So I thought essentially, what if I just land in the fields and hold the brakes to try and slow down as much as possible before then accelerating to take off. I'm proud of that pilot though. He can get out and escape. Good for him. Hello everyone. I'm currently outside of the RAF Museum in Hendon in the UK. And it's currently closed. Of course it is closed because of COVID restrictions in the UK. But I came here anyway because I wanted to come and see the HE 162 Volkswagen. And I got the next best thing, which is my own makeshift plushie. Yes, I think it is absolutely adorable. And you should get yourself one of these right now. Link in the description of the video below. I think link down below in the description. Just go get one now. It's around for only the next two weeks. I think makeshift did a fantastic job with this plushie and you should pick yourself up one of these now. Go get it now. Next time, hopefully when COVID isn't over, I'll take the plushie, we'll go visit the Volkswagen inside. I don't think I can even get there actually. I'm barely doing, no. I need to level off and build up some speed.
Soccer Wolf on 90s, what are you doing? Fuck, now all I can do is dogfight other planes. Thank you, 190s, for doing your fucking job. I'm Armenian angry. Okay, I'm gonna save the 177 by engaging that Spitfire. Did the 177 die? Because he dropped off my radar. I saw the Spitfire down there, so he must be still there, right? I'm waiting for... Oh, Contrail. And where there's a Contrail, there's a plane. I see him. Hmm, I don't think he's noticed me, so this is going to be a good intercept. He's noticed me. Keep the speed up, keep the smile up, just go. Ah! Ah! I'm playing like a rhythm dodging minigame right now. Thank god I did have the energy to outclimb him. The oil leak's still gonna be very annoying. I'm going to go after the F-82, because I don't really think I can dogfight the P-51 in this state. But the F-82 is a bit more chonk. Hmm, I'm lined up for this guy, though. The engine's going to start breaking down in the next two or three minutes. Nope, got a, got a bail on it. Come on, come on little 162, give it to your all, give it your best. Come on. Get the speed up. He's catching up with me, isn't he? Oh man, even the P-47's catching up with me. No rest for the weary. Okay, luckily that friendly air was able to kind of give him a reason to disengage. I don't think I'm making it back to base, because even at max web in this dive, I'm not really accelerating. Maybe, maybe I might make it back to base if the engine actually holds up. You'll see it slowly change in colour over time, and the more damage it takes, the less output it puts out. There was a mini airfield, I missed it, I flew past the mini airfield on the way to the big one. Okay, I'm good. Fuck it, I'll go back for the mini one. I don't think I'll make it to the big one. No, I'm not going to make it. I'm going to have to land. I'm going to have to land this. Oh, fuck. I need a straight area to land in, and this is most certainly not straight. This is it. I can't even turn. I'm braking. I'm shooting. I'm doing everything. Slow down. Can't drift too hard. Oh. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Drift! Oh, deja vu! I'm drifting on 162! Let's land. Oh my, let's let the engine cool down. Oh, fuck me. Maybe I can taxi at home. Where does this river go, right? The elevation of this airfield is quite high, so we're not going to get back up here, but this airfield, I think, is pretty low elevation. Now, we could take a left and a right and go down this tributary, or we could go all the way down here and then all the way up here. I don't think that will work. We'll just go this way. We're not even breaking 11 kph. <laughs> With the whip. <laughs> this is sad. <laughs> this is just sad. She's generating all the power she's got, Captain. Ah, my plan of letting the engine cool down and then taxiing doesn't really work when... I'm giving it all the power I got and I'm not going above 4 kph now. <laughs> RIP all the bearings and pieces of turbine that just melted themselves now. I'll turn off the engine, I don't think there's anything else left in it. I guess this is it for the HE-162, it's not going any further with the black engine. It still runs. Oh wow, you know it's cold outside when the engine temperature drops to zero. Minus one! 
And even with the minus, like, minus three Celsius, the engine was still hot, the oil. Beautiful day for HG162 ice skating. Do I count as dead? Uh, no, I didn't die. Yeah, fuck the other player that tried to shoot me down. I did not technically die. Ah, P51 trying to go into the vertical, eh? I am the vertical. Get nay-nayed. Can't believe you're trying to outclimb a jet. The future is now, prop man. The future is jets. Please ignore the engine about to fucking explode from mild overheating. Ah, I mean, I must say, the 50 cows do be hitting not so hard today. Come on. I'm actually out. Come on, engine. Give it all you got, all the extra welly. I'm pushing it as hard as I can. I need speed. Right, engine's gonna bust soon. I need to point this towards the airfield and keep the weapon. on. Like, seriously, I must be the luckiest 162 pilots ever lived. Oh, that's a fire that I might not be able to put out. I turn off the engine. Hold! Ah, that's a bad case of the fucking explosion. Uh, gear? Gear's coming down. <laughs> German engineering. The greatest hydraulic system you've ever seen. The engine doesn't exist, the tail section doesn't exist, but by golly, does the gear still come down like butter. Don't you just love it? Most planes have WEP, war extra power. No. The HU-162's overclocking ability is not 101%, not 104% like on some British planes. Not 105%. It goes all the way up to 108 Percent engine output. It's like turning the dial to 11 and then you just turn it to 18 out of 10. How cool is that? TA-152, shut the fuck up. Do not fucking go for the Lancaster. I swear to fucking God. I mean, yes, you have equal right to go for whatever plane you want in War Thunder. I mean, nothing's tying you to go for- Go for the fucking fighter planes! Oh, you absolute bellend. You absolute knob sprinkle. Listen, mate, I'm a jet plane. Just let me do what jet planes do. You're a prop plane that is meant to intercept, you know, high altitude planes, but just go kill the fighter planes. Please. Do me a bloody favor, mate. Listen, mate, the Lancaster is already terrified that a plane is coming for him. I mean, he's probably scared the 162 is gunning for him, but at least he knows he stands a slight chance. So please, for the love of God, do not go after the Lancaster guy. That was a lot of bits and bobs lost. Wait, my gear fell off? Oh, I probably pressed the gear button instead of the flaps button. Hey, look, they, hey, that's actually pretty neat. Gaijin modeled in the little window for the pilot to see if the gear's up. Oh, yeah, that's right, I'm dogfighting. Just hang in there, little buddy. I'm coming to save you. Oh, look, it's the 152. Mm, yes, um, I seem to be having a weapons jam right now. Having issues with the guns. Oh, shame. Oh, well, might just all be too early. Don't really see the point in saving you. Don't have a reason. Ah, oh, you got to live. Uh, I mean, yay, you lived. Hmm, shame. And that's it, we won. That was like the most boring one, two, three, one, two, three, six player game. Iron, are you the new Justin? Why? I see you in all the new comments. 
See, Justin Wyatt is now dead. All embrace iron. Because I haven't seen Justin Wyatt for like two years. And all it takes is me doing like five comments a day. And apparently I'm everywhere on YouTube. I don't leave that many comments. <gasps> oh, no! <laughs> Come on, Anton! I swear to God, that arrow was over the halfway mark. It was over halfway! Bruh! <laughs> so they've made like a max, it used to be a 100k maximum and they moved it up to 500,000 jackpot now. Is this what it's like to play a gacha and not pull your waifu? Bruh. How do I unlock planes and stuff so far into the tech tree? It's called asking Gaijin very nicely for stuff. And also maybe playing the game since like 2014. That kind of helps. Let's see, let's try and cut off the B-17 to where he's going. No point heading where he is. It also seems like he's doing a slight descent. He's, oh, he's trying to hit the bombing point before I intercept. That BF-109 might be trying to climb as well. Yeah, so that B-17 is doing a shallow... Oh, that's a pretty steep climb. Uh, your lead is a bit off, mate. And you're stalled out. Congrats. I think he's firing some traces at me. Or is the sun glinting off him? I am not sure. No, I don't want to fall into a six. I wanted to intercept from the side. I fell into a six. This is bad. It's a G variant as well, so I couldn't attack head on. Yes, this is the German air police. Pull over now. You are in German air. Oh, fuck. He's dropped bombs. Pull over now and you will slightly be harmed. Only a little. Listen, mate, you're not damaged yet. Oh, fuck, he's <laughs> taking fire from the suspect. <laughs> suspect is hostile, need backup. <laughs> In pursuit now. <laughs> I can't even really catch up to the guy. So I'm just trying to stay a little bit out of the suspect's range. Oh, I think he's not being so optimal with this dive. What's he going for now? Oh, he broke his wings off. Or gear with flaps or something. Okay, let's try and light his turning t Oh, mate! Oh, you absolute knob bellend. Fuck you. Mate, if you kill me there as well. What? What an absolute bellend, though. B-17 actually just killed the 162. What the fuck is that? So basically you're telling me a new B-17 strategy is to snap your wings at the last second and when the plane is still coming at you, you should still shoot them down. And that way they don't get the kill and you can still get a kill on the way to hell. Wow. That is some absolute cringe if I do say so. I hope you guys bought the plushie because I'm freezing my ass out here. <laughs> Come to... I came all the way to the Army of Endon and it's snowing and I know I couldn't get inside anyway but I just wanted to go by the entrance to pick up the plushie now just do it now go to description down below comment section pin comment you have no excuse get the plushie now it's only around for two weeks get it now